Hi everyone, my name is Aurora and welcome to this video. Today we're taking a look into my third year on YouTube. I know, I know, I'm like four months late <laughs> with this anniversary type video, but if you've been following me around, you might have noticed that some things have changed around here, mostly because I just moved across the world <laughs> a few months ago from Croatia all the way to Canada for my PhD. So, you know, life has been so hectic and so stressful and I just didn't have the time and the energy to sit down and confront like face to face the statistics of YouTube because they can be scary, not gonna lie. So there is that. Before we get to it any further, please let me know when did you join this community? Was it like a week ago, a month ago, a year ago? Were you here from the beginning or maybe this is your first time watching? If it is, Welcome! <laughs> I hope you're gonna enjoy what you see here. Probably in the, not in this video because it's gonna be boring for most of you. But it's for the fellow sociologists and fellow content creators who might be looking into some more realistic numbers to see what they themselves can expect when it comes to YouTube growth. You know, not all of us can go viral one night and then wake up next day with millions of uh, subscribers. So the rest of us just have to like be more patient with it. First we're gonna look into the overall milestones that this channel has gathered in the whole total of three years and then we're gonna take a look into the third year specifically. So when it comes to the overall statistics I have to say that I'm mind blown when it comes to the amount of support that I'm getting here. This channel has more than 660,000 overall views. It is mind blowing, it is crazy. Most of it of course, it comes from the shorts, not gonna lie, like 645,000 <laughs> views actually comes from the shorts, but that's okay. Fine, I'm cool, I'm fine. When it comes to the subscribers in this small community of ours here, there is 1,120 people. How? <laughs> Honestly, when I started this whole journey, I thought that maybe after like three years, I'll have maybe 17 subs. I'm not even exaggerating. <laughs> This is honestly what I thought, because I thought that no way that people would be actually interested to see and hear what I have to say and show. So there is that. But I have to say that of the, all of you who are watching this right now, 88% of you are not subscribed. Why? Let me know, please, so I can change it. <laughs> if you don't want to commit, I mean, that's okay, I'm not gonna push you. <laughs> but, but it would be nice to, you know, give some support. Maybe you want to be a part of my art that I create for all of my followers or something that, you know, there are some perks of being a member of this community, not many, but I'm working on it. <laughs> be patient. When it comes to how those overall views and the number of you all who are watching this video comes to the watch time, which is very important when it comes to monetization, this channel has more than 2,700 watch time hours. <laughs> Crazy. I mean, when I first started, I couldn't you know, hold your attention for more than 30 seconds. At this point, most of you <laughs> would already be gone. <laughs> so this is a huge improvement. Of course, there is a long, long way to go until I get to the monetization point. So far, so good. I didn't see anything, like, bad. Now let's dig deeper into the demographics. Like, who are you? <laughs> the people who are actually watching this. Where are you from? Where did you go? Where did you come from? You know who you are. <laughs> I'm not gonna tell you, you exactly, but you know, like a, an average person that actually watches this video. The top two countries that all of my viewers come from are US and India, with 12.5% each. The next two are interestingly Canada and Croatia, like together, uh, with 4.8% each. This is interesting and I think this is mostly because I moved and you know YouTube likes to promote videos locally to the local communities so when I was in Croatia it went to Croatian people and now that I live in uh, Canada it's more recommended to Canadians and that's fine. At least there is a bit more people in Canada than it was Croatia so maybe I have a bit more chance now. And then the last country I want to mention now is UK with 3.5% of all of the viewers coming from there. Uh, when it comes to videos specifically, uh, like long-term videos like this one, 12.4% uh, are from Croatia, which I guess makes sense because, you know, my friends and family members like to support me. The next one is US and then France, Sweden and Guatemala, which is very exciting. When it comes to the age, 
The predominant group is the group between 25 and 35, which makes sense because I myself am 25. So most of my peers and colleagues and everybody who follows me actually is uh, around the same age. The next group is the age group of 18 to 24 with 24.9% of you all. And then the last like big group is the age group of 35 to 45 with 22.8% uh, total people actually being in that age group. These three groups are the most uh, predominant and that I guess makes sense. And when it comes to the gender, there is 53.5% of you who identify as women. Now let's get into the third year statistics specifically. There are some of the things that I want to mention. First of all, are you know the same the statistics I just mentioned for the overall on the channel, and then some specifics such as the most viewed shorts, because I honestly can't believe what kind of stuff goes. I guess in the last year, this channel has grown the most in the whole three years, especially in like the end of 2022. So literally a year. Go. We grew by 833 subscribers, which is more than a half, so that's very, very impressive. We crossed the 500 sub mark a year ago, literally at the start of December 2022. And then in July 2023, we crossed the 1000 mile mark, which both of those things were mind blowing and never expected. <laughs> by myself i just i would never see such numbers so it was so nice to you know get there uh it was so nice to know that so many people actually care and want to see more of my content i guess and it was also nice to actually get a little card from youtube in my mail with all of the bananas and not gonna lie it's all of it is very great because this represents the first milestone that i need to actually monetize this channel and perhaps have some like side income from it all which would be amazing considering how much tuition costs in canada it's crazy i digress <laughs> back to the statistics in the last year this channel has gathered more than half a million views half a million views can you believe this can you hear how crazy that sounds i i can't like <laughs> i'm not okay with this i i can't even imagine not only that but youtube has shown like my video or short or post whatever to more than one million and four hundred thousand people one million and four hundred thousand people like should i say it louder for the people in the back i mean this is crazy <laughs> it seems like i'm at least doing something right if youtube wants to recommend me so much so that's great Last year I also got more than 12,000 likes. I do not count my dislikes because I don't need that type of negativity in my life. So I don't know what number those are and I'm gonna stay the Lulu and believe there aren't any. Even though I know I see them in the graphs but I just refuse to acknowledge them. When it comes to the type of content that I published in the last year, overwhelmingly <laughs> I published shorts. To be exact, 350 of them. Well, I only posted six long-term videos seven if we count this one <laughs> and that's it and it's understandable considering the type of year that i had and the amount of like brain power i was working on it to just not manageable so shorts were an amazing way for me to still communicate with you all and share some things that are happening in my life without making it feel so overwhelming because this is after all not a job for me it's just like a hobby like a creative outlet and it needs to stay as stress-free as possible. I want to mention five shorts that were actually the most watched videos uh, on this channel in the last year because I want to bring attention to how stupid those videos are. This little effort I actually put into those five videos, which is crazy because they're the ones who actually blew up the most, so... I don't know what to think about how this YouTube world works, but I guess the rule of the thumb is less uh, work you put into, the more shitted <laughs> you feel about the work you do, it's actually gonna you know, perform better. So I guess just believe in your shit. Life lessons. The first, the biggest video on my channel is the video called Which Sketch is Your Favorite? It has 44,000 views. It got more than 118 subs 
that one video it was the biggest like i'm still chasing that high <laughs> literally a year ago because i i don't know how how did the algorithm pick it up or what happened because i've been doing everything the same most of the time so it doesn't make sense that just this one illustration video was so much better than literally anything else that i've put on this channel second most viewed video is even more stupid <laughs> Because this one is just an illusion. I literally asked people which way does the car go, left or right, and people went crazy about it with more than 16.9 thousand views. Okay, I guess this is the type of content I should look into. Maybe I should turn into a magician. The third one is imagine this. Uh, it is how I matched with a stranger on a gallery event a few months ago when I went to a trip abroad. And uh, this video has 13.7 thousand views. The next one has almost the same number of views and it's called Sunday walks are always the most fashionable, which is me making fun of myself for looking like total crap while walking my dog to take a crap. <laughs> and the last one is, can you guess the name of my dog? Nobody did. Her name is Namiri. This video has more than 9,000 views. So there it is. These are the five most viewed videos on my uh, channel. This is a sign for you to, even if you have like the most stupid idea possible, film it, put it online, and somebody will like it. <laughs> Just how the internet goes. Life lessons. Anyway, I hope that you enjoyed this very quick, very brief, but also very important uh, milestone because I want to keep on doing this, uh, you know, look back because every day this channel grows a little bit bigger at least one person subscribes at least two people watch some video or whatever so i feel like it is something that's brewing and brewing and brewing and maybe one day it will blow up or maybe it will just simmer like a very nice soup who knows i mean i'm here for the ride of it i enjoy making these videos for you and i enjoy interacting with you all and I still have to figure out what I'm gonna do for the second thousand people in this community because for the first thousand, if you know, I made two canvases filled with flowers, literally a thousand flowers that represents each and every one of you. So now I have to figure out something else to do for the second thousand. I still haven't because I never believed that I would get this far, so I have nothing planned. It's the story of my life, I guess. But anyway, I hope this inspired you to actually pursue your YouTube dreams. Just three years ago, I had none videos uploaded. I had zero subs. Now I have 500 videos uploaded and all of these subs and views and everything else that you just you know, hear me say. So it is possible. You just have to try. You just have to put yourself out there. I believe in you. You believe in me. We get each other. Considering the rules of YouTube, the less effort you put into it, the better it will turn out. So I guess you can never go wrong. Anyway, I have 20 seconds uh, on my memory card, so I'm just gonna say hi now. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. If you did, like it, hit the subscribe button, and I'll see you some other time. Bye!